Hello and welcome from Hike Vision. My name is Dan Hawkins and I'm part of the product pre-sales team here at Hike. Today we're going to look at how you use your DS-1105 KI network keyboard. We'll look at how you control a recorder when it's in keyboard mode. We'll look at how to change cameras and use playback and PTZ control on that specific keyboard monitor. The aim of this video is to show you how to use some of the core functions of the DS1105 network keyboard, taking advantage of its built-in 7-inch touchscreen monitor. This little monitor is an incredibly useful tool, so it's worth knowing how to make the most of it. A good example is a reception area, where you can't have a 22-inch or a 19-inch monitor on the desk. Use the keyboard monitor to be able to view a back entrance, for example. It acts like a spot monitor from a DVR or an MBR. So the keyboard is very versatile, has a good user interface, and the ability to use pan, tilt, and zoom control. We can also view, playback, and see multiple monitors on the small screen. But how do we use the DS-1105 KI network keyboard? So how do we use the DS-1105 KI keyboard's monitor? Firstly, from the home page on the keyboard screen, go into keyboard mode. This is the yellow icon on the right hand side. Touch this on the touch screen and then enter in your password. Use the touch screen to enter your password in, hit return and press login. You'll be taken to the keyboard menu. Now from here, select your monitor and your camera using the keyboards and camera button. In this instance, monitor zero, Camera number one is our first PTZ camera. From here, I can use the PTZ controls, to move the camera around, zoom in, zoom out, usual PTZ controls. However, if I want to see playback, press the playback button up at the top, select the correct time. We want to look for May 2021, so 07, 06, 05. We'll go to the 24th yesterday. And there we have playback, 24th May 2021 at midnight. Touch the screen and the time bar will appear down the bottom. If we scroll this along, we can select the appropriate time. So we've moved up to 9.44. Now, if I want to move away from here, press the cross button. But you can also do a multi-view from the, cam the keyboard's local monitor. Full multi will give us a four-way multi-split. Pressing the camera icon in the top corner means that we can select different cameras. Just touch the quadrant that you want to change and then tap the camera buttons. Close that mini window and you'll have a four-way split. Now if any of those are PTZs, just touch that quadrant and you'll be able to control that particular PTZ. I hope you found this brief how-to video on the DS1105KI useful. Don't forget to visit our website as shown below at hikevision.com UK. If you want more information, including additional how-to videos, search Hike Vision UK Technical Support on YouTube, and you'll find an ever-expanding library of short guides to choose from. Bye for now.